When I was 13, I was diagnosed with a degenerative eye disease called retinitis pigmentosa. And that pretty much means that you're going to lose all your sight and it'll slowly deteriorate throughout your life. Losing that and then my skating on top of that was just like, you know, ripping your heart out and whatever. It just like when you're that depressed, like I was, I felt like it just got taken away from me. It's as gnarly as it gets, you know? Like you're that passionate about something and then I couldn't do it anymore. So it just changed my whole attitude, you know, feelings and everything just towards life. To truly understand my process, you have to understand my loss of sight. I've lost 95% of my sight. When it comes to actually skating the spot, I really use it as orientation to help line myself up with whatever it is I'm skating. So imagine rolling up to a ledge and blacking out 95% of your field of vision and that remaining 5% is like looking through a dirty, hazy window. All that I can really see are shadows, contrast, and light perception. So my process for skating anything it's way harder and it's like a lot sketchier for me than what I used to see. So pretty much what I have to do is find my crack. I know I'm coming up closer. There's my obstacle with my cane. Pretty much anything, it's about like lining the obstacle up with some kind of reference point or any kind of deal that I can just let myself know like, all right, with this much speed, as soon as you feel that object, it's time to pop, you know? going into the blind world and skating as a blind person, I'm gonna be able to overcome that and hopefully, you know, really set the goal high for other blind people, you know, just show them like what's possible and push themselves. The blind skateboarding. I can just find my hand. Do my face. Boom. The minute you feel that, falling. I'm gonna try to alley without my cane. Without the cane. It's fun until you realize the dangers of it. If you ever lose your eyesight, you're gonna give up skateboarding? Probably not. Yeah. No way. 
he doesn't land his first kickflip, he's gonna need to do some push-ups. Oh! Hey, he used the no cane. He used the cane. I oh! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh. No stopping, no hesitation, straight forward motivation. earlier I told Dan yeah you're going straight you're going straight and then he ended up jumping into the rail it felt so bad oh, almost got ran over by a car but he did it